so hello people welcome you all today in my new video topic where we are gonna compare about the FESE and the newly launched app FES64 which I have already reviewed in my uh, previous video so I think you all have watched but if you haven't watched the video I have given the link in the description as well as in the comment section so you can go there to watch the full video of FES64 app so but in this video topic we are gonna discuss about and compare about the apps FES and FES64 so let's get started So, before starting the video, I want to give you all a short description about the app FESE for Android. So, basically talking about the app FESE for Android, it is the fastest and the most uh, compatible PS1 emulator for the handheld devices. Uh, it has uh, more than 5 lakh download in the Play Store and rated up to 4.5 star in the Play Store, which is pretty good for any of the Android app in the Play Store. So, uh, FESE is... Um, able to render ps1 games in high resolution by using opengl uh, which gives outstanding graphics and talking about the audio and the sound in the app it is uh, beyond the comparison to any of the apps so uh, overall the app is pretty awesome So let's talk about the app FES64 for Android. So in this app you get the option of multiplayers and after clicking in the multiplayers you get an interface like this where you can select local network multiplayer or internet multiplayer as per your interest. After clicking in it you can get various options including the um, including the game local network player you can play as player 1 2 3 and 4 which is pretty good function of this app which supports various kind of multiplayer games which can let anyone playing with up to four players over the local network on a wi-fi 5 or 6 to ps1 multiplayer game so because of the feature of multiplayer also the app is gaining a lot of popularity and a lot of downloads uh, as it supports for the multiplayer which is pretty good for any of the games and players playing any kind of games through this app. You can also get audio setting in this app and advanced audio setting through which you can enable and disable the audio according to your necessity. Morely, you can also get the game pair setting in the next advanced game pair setting also for the quick save and lower path. So talking about the difference between two apps, FES and FES64, what's the differences between two apps? So let's see. So the app FES64 has a new interface which covers the display in high definition and it also has the country flag. So, an option tuned to frame rate from 20 FPS to 200 FPS without breaking music tempo, which is a good uh, thing for uh, any app. So, the game is accelerated or slowed down, but the music is still playing normally. Uh, this is also a good feature you can say. Support for the famous CSD uh, is also compressed file format. Very useful for game with audio tracks with late deleted file size by 10 compressed to other format. Support for OpenGL high definition, or high definition, XPR algorithm to have to have a much better rendering. Support for 4x or 16x upscaling algorithm for software smooth video mode based on XPR algorithm to have a impressive result, especially with 2D games. Support for an exclusive multiplayer mode based on the cast like uh, mechanism. Some on a free uh, light remote player available to play with the mode without full FESC. So it has many more improvement in comparison to the app FESC. So this is the interface of the app FESE. After downloading the app, you can see the interface like this, uh, including the load game setting where you can save and reload your game setting and other many more other features. Whereas talking about the new app FES64 for Android, you get the features uh, same as the FES, but it has little improvement, including the multiplayer. Uh, you can play the games run as multiplayer, where you can uh, play up to four, four people over local network and up to five to six player to PS1 multiplayer using the OpenGL, which is pretty good for any of the Android PS1 emulator. So if I have to talk about the major difference of the, both the app FES and FES64, I can say that the app FES64 is the next generation updated version of previous app FES, which led the users many more um, advanced and the uh, next generation features. I have given the link of both the apps in my description and the comment section, so simply you can uh, go 
there and download the apps. So this much for now. 